up guys so today we're back uh we're doing a home depot run with my brother brian um right now we're in his uh what year is this 2007 his 2007 5.7 liter hemi jeep so right now we're just going to home depot to pick up some of that uh wood because we're going to be creating making some uh, diffuser for his 2016 mustang 5.0 you should check it out it's pretty wet you'll see it in a minute but we'll get back to you once we're at home depot picking up all the parts so first we're going to get the material that we use to make like our splitters and our diffuser everything that we have done so far and we always get it here at home depot <laughs> we always get it here at one? home depot no it's this one this stuff right here this thin stuff it's like a mixture of cardboard plastics and wood it has a nice shiny surface even though we sand it down because you know we got to make it weatherproof my man right here he's gonna cut it up into three different pieces so hopefully it all comes out well so now we're just getting the bolts and pieces to have the whole thing put together so now we just gotta go get the L brackets. Now we're here getting the little L brackets so that we can mount them up to the boards and then from the boards to the bumper. From right here, we're picking up the plastic dip, all the paint to um, do his bumper and all. And then the man, he says, hey, wouldn't it be dope if we make the fence glow in the dark? <laughs> Honestly, I don't, I, I don't know. You really want that? No, watch everybody start doing that now. Okay, like, comment no comment below, see what you guys think, if we should do it, if not. I mean, uh, we can always go back, send it down, and we can put that glow-in-the-dark stuff, but let us know down in the comments if you think we should do that. So, we're back in the sleeper Jeep, <laughs> and now we're just heading out home to get ready to start doing all the templates, and then start marking up stuff, hopefully have it done by today. Weber's, you know we out uh, here? Weber's uh, doing the vlog. Take a picture of the before. Take a picture of the before? The before, yeah. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, 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 hey! What's up, man? Stop, it looks like a man. We got all the kids out here. We got the pregnant ones out here. We got the, the race things out here. And we are doing... We are doing a front splitter, which is currently in the works. We're also going to build hey guys, we're back. that diffuser thing, your pap. It'll be wet. And we got the new splitter that will be going on made out of this. What is this? Well, basically, it's called um, it's like some type of like compound wood plastic material. It's pretty cool though. Question of the day is, how come you didn't consult your wife about these changes you're making? No, no comment. He said no comment. <laughs> Alright, so far, that's what we got. So basically what he's doing over there, mocking up a cardboard uh, fin. Template. Template. Whatever. And then we measured from here to here, which was about 10 inches, I think. Right, Uncle? Uh, yeah, 10 inches. 10 inches. And then we're going to have to cut out this curve right here. You know it's going to go down. Gonna go it's going to go straight and then back. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. When you get everybody to talk about? <laughs> you get the Our taco, before. that ain't mine. Out uh, here. They're probably all the same. The big box. No, they're not. We've got a gusto, cutting up the template right there. We got this thing all taped up almost. Mm. Whose soda is that? <laughs> what? Whose soda is that? I almost just tipped it. You didn't see it? My baby right here. <laughs> That's close enough because then when we cut it out of wood, yeah, but I, I it's see. all about sanding down and making it to the but perfect fit. Why not make the template perfect too? to paint this black, the fins. Boom. That's, that's yeah, literally perfect. He's just working, you know what I'm saying? Getting shit done. And then. What? <laughs> <laughs> so right 
Right now, Nathan, he's uh. Getting shit done is what I'm doing. Marking everything with the template, getting all four corners to get the two diffusers. <clears throat> so basically, it's gonna be two, fuse, two diffusers in here, one there, one there, same on the other side, and then we're gonna have to modify a different one to have one sticking out from right here on the side. We're gonna see what we can do with that because there it's more curvy and there's nothing to grab onto, but we'll work our magic and do something. So we got the first, first fin. The tape actually works. <laughs> so from this, we just gotta sand all the edges down, make it look nice and even. That's pretty much it. First layer of plastic. That's how it has to look, right? First layer, second layer a little thicker, and third layer final. What was that, Brian? Um, we got the man. Oh, oh shit. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Hey, Nathan. I don't represent. Hey. What are these called again? Fins. No. These are fins? No. These are, um. Diffuser fins. Diffuser fins. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because we're not. It's in the, not a we are here, guys. Uh, locally, I'm. First time on the vlog, uh, by the way, my name is uh, Brian, Follow aka him. Che Baby Ten, aka right here. Put on Instagram, aka Che. Um, hit me up, Che Baby Ten, Instagram. We out here, Single. my ride. Single. We're trying to, we're trying to have a, trying to have a good time. You feel me? Make things a little bit better than show, what they used to be. This. Did we show them the splitter? The splitter that we made for the five out? Yeah, I did. Already. That's not too crazy. Progress. Fresh layer coat. Hey, but hold up, hold up. We got to represent. We got to represent. We got to represent. Get the. The rods. We got second coat down in this thing. We'll give it one more coat. No, no, we couldn't get We got splitter painted so far. Shiny black paint. Can't really see it, but it has a little sparkle. Let's see, I can see everything. The little like sparkles. It's OEM Chrysler paint that we got from O'Reilly's. And it has like these little sparkles in it, so that's pretty cool. Why don't you clear coat that first? Whoa. We got first coat of clear coat on there. We're using the same brand fast dip glossifier. Then we got the GT 350 we can clear coated so far. Looking pretty shiny. Then we got the wings over here. The wings. I mean the fins and the brackets all getting painted. Oh yeah. The splitter almost done pretty much. Lost black. Just needs a few more touches. We got the little lip Don't around touch it. it. It's still wet. We just gotta heat it up. Oh shit. <laughs> Why don't you go to the other side? I'll hold it from here. Something like that. Not bad, huh? Two coats of pla three coats of plastic, two coats of uh, clear, clear glossifier. That's what it's looking like. Actually, looks pretty good. These guys are very cleaning this car. Cleaning this car, we're not even done yet. Head us up for any of your paint needs. Came out pretty wet. Locally hit a garage. We out here. Shit. Don't fall now, bro. No! Not the Tims! Not the Tims! Damn it. Look at the moon. It's beautiful. Oh, that's just a light. Never mind. Um, so we got a gusto. <laughs> Brian over here is cutting up the brackets. So pretty much, it's gonna go like right there. So you cut the edge. See that? One bolt right nice here. Flush. One bolt right here. 
Should I turn on the flash? That's all good. Yeah, I should definitely turn on the flash. And it's gonna go like that. Nice. So that's why we had to cut off that little tip right there. Otherwise, it would have been like, yeah, nobody wants like it. that. That's no good for business. Welcome to Hitty Garage. We are here. Hit us up. Quick update. Touching, touching these up, obviously. Uh, we got the brackets on there. Getting ready to put the fins on. Little sneak peek. What it's gonna look Freaking like. Freaking sauce, dude. Still holding it. Get through the fins right here. Can you put it at the bottom? Okay. Somebody just got snapped. I can't see though. Please be careful with my finger. <laughs> We're using self tap droop screws. Um, if you would like to be more secure, you could use normal screws and get a nut from the top of the bumper. But for now, we're just using. Is this straight, tap. Nathan? I can't see what you guys are. Looks about right. On the line. Check it. That's where it should be. You already know, hit us up, look at the hit a garage. We out here. Uh, you tell me how you want it. Number two. Wait, put it more more we straight, Nathan. Right? You know what though? Is it clean? Oh, oh they're, they're not okay. all the way painted. Just gotta touch it. Number two. We'll do it by hand, we'll do it by hand. Okay. It looks right. Yep. Yeah, I'll give you guys a up close and personal view. So we just gotta what? we're probably gonna give these these fins another coat of paint. Cause it's like kind of sucking it in, even though it's plastic. But we're gonna give another coat. We're gonna fix this right here. A bit of a plastic error. But we'll get that fixed here soon. Actually, I'm gonna fix it right now. But I'm not gonna put that in the video. Um, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Looking good. Looking good. So that's pretty much it for today, guys. We'll be back with the side fin on both sides. We still got to do those. And then that same day, we're going to probably do the front um, splitter. So stay tuned for that. If you guys like this, like, comment, subscribe. And stay tuned for the next splitter video. And to finish the diffuser by with the twin fins that we haven't designed yet. <laughs>